Stockholm tests new ambulance warning system. Accidents involving ambulances and some modern vehicles are on the rise in Sweden. This is because some cars are so well insulated against noise that the drivers can't hear the emergency sirens until it's too late. In response, ambulances in the country's capital city are now testing a new emergency warning system. Stockholm ambulances are trialing a system that emits an FM radio signal, which is picked up by vehicles with a radio data system. Drivers own stereo systems then alert them to slow down and make space for an approaching ambulance. The system interrupts all audio playback inside vehicles with a voice announcement about the presence of an ambulance nearby. The announcement is accompanied by a text message on the stereo tuner's display. According to the system developers, the optimal warning time for drivers is 10 to 15 seconds. The developers say the system reaches two-thirds of vehicles on the road and can also warn them of accidents ahead. The system calculates the speed of traffic to anticipate how far ahead warning signals need to be sent. For example, on a highway, the signal will be broadcast earlier than in slow-moving city traffic. The developers say the system will enhance accessibility for first responders, improve road safety, and make life a whole lot easier for ambulance drivers. Here's some more examples of life-saving technology. Rolling guardrail could prevent fatal road accidents. A South Korean company has designed a rolling guardrail system that is almost unbreakable in accidents, which means it could save even more lives than traditional guardrails during serious auto accidents. The rolling guardrail consists of rotating barrels made of ethylene vinyl acetate and metal frames. It has a luminescent quality which makes it highly visible to drivers during the night. When a car hits the guardrail, the barrels rotate to convert shock energy from the vehicle into rotational energy. As a result, the car is propelled forward back onto the road rather than breaking through the barrier. The upper and lower frames of the guardrail can prevent the steer systems of both large and small vehicles from suffering a loss of function. The company manufactures different types of rolling barriers, and the system has already been installed on many roads in South Korea. The survival capsule could save your life during a natural disaster. The survival capsule was designed to help save lives during a tsunami. The 2011 tsunami off Japan's coast that killed almost 16,000 people and injured 6,000 more was inspiration to survival capsule creators Julian Sharp and Scott Hill. The two designed the capsule with the less mobile, the elderly, the infirm, and the young in mind. In emergency situations, a survival capsule could act as a safety shelter for those who have problems evacuating, especially on a last minute's notice. The capsules are spherical metal cages sheathed in aircraft-grade aluminum shells to absorb impact. The internal walls are lined with ceramic thermal blankets to protect from extreme heat. And each capsule is equipped with a 60-minute air tank in case it's submerged underwater. The capsules come in five different capacities, ranging from two to ten people, each with varying seating designs. Tsunami waves typically flow around 25 miles per hour, but survival capsules tests have found that the capsule can withstand impacts from objects at up to 75 miles per hour. Survival capsules are currently available for pre-order. This origami robot could save your kid's life. An international team of researchers have teamed up to make a tiny folding robot that can remove button batteries from the stomach. The gadget is designed to be swallowed in a capsule and unfolds like origami inside the human body. It was created by researchers at MIT, the University of Sheffield in England, and the Tokyo Institute of Technology. The robot is made of dried pig intestines and is designed to remove batteries from the stomach it is powered by a magnet and folds up so it is easily ingested inside a capsule. Some 3,500 watch batteries are swallowed in the U.S. each year, posing the risk of burning to the stomach and esophagus. Once inside the stomach, the capsule dissolves and the robot unfolds. The robot propels itself in a stick-slip motion and is steered by external magnetic fields. The robot's magnet attaches itself to the battery and removes it from the stomach. 
Most batteries swallowed by humans are digested normally, but prolonged contact can see hydroxide burn through tissue. This poses a particular risk to children, as the hydroxide can burn a hole through the esophagus, which can lead to death. And that, the researchers say, is what makes this little folding robot such a useful invention. UPS tests drone delivery of medicine in Massachusetts. Logistics company UPS has partnered with drone maker Sci-Fi Works to conduct a test delivery using a drone last Thursday. The autonomous drone is battery powered and equipped with night vision. It also features a secure communication system, preventing information from being intercepted or disrupted. During the test flight, the drone flew from Beverly, Massachusetts to Children's Island, which cannot be accessed by cars. The drone flew three miles over the Atlantic Ocean and successfully delivered an asthma inhaler to a child at the camp. Sci-Fi Works said the drones are not going to replace delivery trucks, but are designed to make deliveries to remote or difficult to access locations.